Uh, so welcome back guys and now we are still making our home here in this project and we are still here on the outside and uh, we are still planning of course. so this one we can I'm trying to make this so we can drag this one and put it there so it'll look good if people they are sitting there and then they are drinking some of their own wines and I can try to look for another one that doesn't look so monotonous so like I can so we can use it inside the house to make a bar so I can put like this one there and maybe I can rotate this one a bit so that people they when they are swimming and some people are drinking and whatever so at least I'm liking what I'm seeing here so let's go here back and then I went to I wanted to go here to the city and here I wanted to see whether we can get some these are those are the plants yes a priest ah uh, what if we put a fountain like if we come here and we try to decorate this one I wanted to put a uh, entrance that this is the entrance that we are having here and I'm trying to plan like uh, if after the entrance you can come here and then you have you find that someone has put a fountain like this one and we can rotate this one to look like that one It's a look good. All no, or we can take this one and we put it somewhere like that one. So um let's see what we have here. So we have water now we can uh come here and we no we have first of all to select this one and then we come and we drop our It's not the way to do it. Let me first of all delete that one. And I'll check on particles, what we have here. We have smoke and everything, so that one we don't need it. Uh, so we come back here to the home. And what I'm looking for is, uh, I don't want to waste too much time on So a bench we don't need it there, billboard we don't need that is a town. Okay, this is what I was looking for. And I was thinking if we put this one there we have to put too many of them. So I'm sorry for this one because I have to rotate all those one. I want to make a fence here. Now we can try to No, but I don't want to become a lazy person. We can first of all put most of them there and then we arrange them. So I'm only first of all going to put them and I then I can try to balance them and arrange them that they look good sometimes it's not good to be lazy so there yeah there's no any other way out so I can come here and I want to see this how it look when I'm close to and 
can click A if you are doing this one you need to be good and quick because if you waste time with small things you have a long video I've learned that one from experience and So I want to click this one. There. And we have still have this one too. So if you're watching this video, you can see how it is not easy sometimes to I see they are not on the same direction, so I have to make them march on the same direction. Every time you are doing a 3D animation, you have to look to the every side because you ca if you don't check on it, you'll find those mistakes when you want to do something like if you want to do an animation, they will still appear on your project and this is sometimes so stupid. Like you need to do some things and you have to be so patient and you have to love what you are doing because this one you cannot do it if you don't love what you are doing So I want to put no still more meshes here and I rotate them. Put another one and rotate them. Put another one and uh, the bad thing about this one is that you cannot plant them like trees. If you put three there you can move them and you plant them. But this one you need to come here and you plant every one of them. Uh, yeah, not planting but pressing. Sometimes I I mix my own language. It is also planting. I think this one is building a fence. Let me not destroy a grish. So, um, patient make things look good. Patient make things look good. There's nothing good that I learned in my life like learning to have patience in doing things. That's the best thing that you can have in your life. Like, if you are the person who doesn't have patience in doing things and judging other people, you should learn how to start on your own principles. What I do here is my free time things and for me it makes fun. And I don't lie about it. I don't do it to have attention from people but I do it to teach people who want to learn something. And people who think that. So my plan was that I wanted to put then I come here and I want to put this one here. And this is a very good idea because I'll show you guys how to make this one rotate. 
as we continue so this one will be an extra video like I put one there so let's see what we have here so this is the thing that I say that if you have to do those things you need to shake them on all direction because sometimes they don't mash the way you want so like if you look at this direction this is too far away from the other one and if you look at this direction the same problem so I'm expecting now that yeah so it's good you're not doing the architecture work here that you have to make everything look exactly if we need that one we can measure so uh let me put this one here now i have to rotate this on the other wheel out So guys, I don't want to waste too much time here doing this work here. This one we can correct it later. Good. Now I can put my mesh here still and rotate them. I'm not going to sell out everything. I'm just doing a first of all here because other people they are asking. I'm going to do the same stupid work for the rest of the video. No, I'm just going to do this video and then on the next we can do something else. So this there I have this one so I can just come and drop one there another one that to look good and now we can come back and now we zoom here and see what we have so I'm going to end this video there and we are going to continue from the next video from there where we left it. So don't keep in touch guys. I'm coming back soon.